what is an eclipse and what causes it. For the demonstrations in this video and for you to try out on your own, make sure to check out the simulations provided by the University of Nebraska Lincoln by searching for UNL astronomy simulations. The simulators used in this video will be under lunar cycles Eclipse Shadow Simulator and Moon Inclination. First, let's explore a lunar eclipse. In observations, a lunar eclipse happens during full moon when the moon over a span of an hour or two darkens greatly. To the naked eye, it will be very dim and slightly red. This darkening happens because as the moon slowly orbits the earth, sometimes it gets behind it. When this happens, the sunlight coming towards the moon is blocked by the earth with the earth casting its shadow on the moon hence it's going to be darkened A solar eclipse happens at the opposite end of the moon's orbit. What is observed is a dark outline coming across the face of the sun. This happens when the moon in its orbit comes between the sun and the earth, hence blocking some of the sunlight out, i.e. casting a shadow on parts of the earth. You may rightly ask, why doesn't an eclipse happen every month? Why is it that eclipses tend to be clustered around certain times of the year and a solar eclipse and a lunar eclipse are often paired with exactly two weeks apart.
The reason is that the orbit of the moon around the Earth relative to the ecliptic plane, which is the orbit of the Earth-Moon system around the Sun, is tilted. As the system orbits the Sun, the alignment of this plane changes. Which means that the Earth, Moon, and Sun alignment only produces a straight line about twice a year. At all other times, the Moon is too small. to align perfectly. To understand more about the orbit of the Moon, make sure to check out the UNL simulations under the subcategory Lunar Cycles.